Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. In today's misconception in astronomy, we are going to talk about the idea, uh, the incorrect idea that black holes behave like cosmic vacuum cleaners sucking up anything near them. So what is a black hole? Well, the answer is, of course, are they cosmic vacuum cleaners? No, they are not. A black hole is a very compact mass in space. So it's a lot of material compressed into a very small amount of space. But the extreme relativistic effects of a black hole are only noted close to the black hole. So only when you get close to the black hole, we have what we call the event horizon here. Within that no light can escape and we cannot know anything about what goes on inside. Outside of that things are things can escape light can escape from outside that event horizon. Now if you get close to the event horizon very strange things will happen. So it you won't, don't want to get too close to an event horizon, but the event horizon is very small for something like our sun. If our sun were compressed to a black hole, it might be only a kilometer or so in size. So it would be very small. And as long as you stayed low, far enough away from that, you could orbit around just as we do. So if you are far from the event horizon, gravity behaves just as it does. So when you get close to a black hole, material can be pulled away. So here we have a star, a black hole and a star orbiting it and material can be pulled off. But note how it's not just sucked in, it's pulled into a disk and it orbits around the black hole, slowly spiraling in to the black hole itself. So it's not that they just suck the material in or rip the star apart. They are taking some material from the star. So black holes can do some unusual things, but they are not the cosmic vacuum cleaners that we think about. And if the sun were to turn into a black hole, leaving its mass exactly the same, just compressing it down much smaller, Earth's orbit would not change. It would get rather cold and dark because we've lost our source of light and heat in the solar system. But the Earth would continue to orbit just as it does today, as would the other planets. Here we see orbits of several several uh, stars around the central mass of the black hole. So the black hole at the center of our galaxy would be here. These are orbits of stars around it. We can map out those orbits as long as they don't get too close to the event horizon. They can remain in stable orbits around the black hole for a long, long time. So let's go ahead and finish up with our summary. First of all, no black holes are not cosmic vacuum cleaners. Objects can orbit a black hole just as they orbit any other object in the universe. The strange effects of black holes are only apparent when you get close to the event horizon. That's when some very strange things start to happen. So that concludes this misconception on the black holes being cosmic vacuum cleaners. We'll be back again next week for another misconception in astronomy. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.